All right, people are back here with the heroes of the match. It's the Viper, the number one finisher, first place of this tournament against an incredible opponent, Mr. Yo, giving the hardest time that you ever had in this tournament so far, Viper. Yeah, for sure. Make sure to come close uh, so that people can hear you. Last time people were complaining, we couldn't hear you, so. Yeah, I don't know, I wasn't expecting him to put up that good of a fight, but I was down 2-0, I was. I've, I've never been so concerned to lose a series in my whole life <laughs> that I was that moment. So he definitely like I don't think I've ever been pushed this hard, you know. Like of course with Jordan it's the same, but like I, I didn't expect you all to perform this well. So I'm very impressed. Uh, but even on that series against Jordan, the best of 21 that Jordan ended up winning, you guys were sort of close the whole time, yeah, right? Yeah. You, you were two games down, mm -hmm. and so what exactly went wrong for you on those two first games? Well, Jordan told me I made a lot of mistakes, but like personally, I felt like I, I played pretty well. Yo just played better. Like I had some hiccups when it comes to my build orders and such. Like Boar went back, and like I didn't have a, like my, I was pushing a dare and rooster, for example. And yeah, and they went back. Yeah, we saw that. We saw that. Those uh, noob errors, so to say. So they kind of hurt me a little bit, but still, he played amazing. So yeah, well, let's start with a game uh, number one where you lost a war. Yeah. Did you feel like that played a role into losing that game? Yeah, of course, but, but I, I made a mistake. I wasn't watching the score because if I was watching the score, I would have seen that he went up that fast. So I was kind of surprised when I saw the uptime and I realized that I sent my Josh forward as well. And if I knew he was going through... You that, missed him. You missed him like one, one tile yeah. or two tiles. Yeah, because if I knew he was going through, then my Josh, I would never go forward with my Josh. Yeah. Yeah. And Mr. Yo, when did you decide to play the forward on Arabia? Was it your plan all along, or after you got the third after board? I got a board. After yeah, you got the board, okay. Because, yeah. Um, I know if if he just two, he will be up to fiddle that fast, and I can just forward him and put tower etc. Okay. Okay, guys, on the chat, if one of the players is not easily hearable, please let us know in the chat. But Mr. Yo, you were played so aggressively every single game. Yeah. Especially land maps, it went forward every single time with villagers, with uh, men at arms. Is that your plan to beat the Viper? You think that putting pressure early on <coughs> is the best way to defeat him? Yeah, and actually, it's it hit just my style. Just your I style of play. Like yeah. that. Okay, yeah. okay. So you felt like you did it really well this time, or what exactly went different? For example, the games you played with him before. Yeah, I was lucky to got a ball and he didn't so that was part of it and I have a perfect map, map to war so even if my forward fail then I can still just war and just imp yeah, imp. imp yeah 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 and uh, Viper was on two TC's for a very long time on that map as well and by the way you missed his war for also a tiny bit yeah. his board and yo missed his board himself on the first game right you will yeah, saw yeah, it a yeah, little yeah. bit later so that would probably have even out things a little bit more let's go into game number two rooster home map of the viper Wee. you surely were expecting to win that one yeah of course of course uh, that's why i picked it as a home map, right <laughs> yeah, yeah well, he, he upped faster than me and he had three galleys really fast and i i was a little bit um uh, you were housed straight away. Yeah, that too. But I, like, I was, I wasn't paying attention at one moment where he suddenly caught me off guard, and from that moment it was just downhill. But I think I fought back fairly well, but still he he had such an advantage from the yeah. Yeah. early game that it was it was gonna be hard anyway. Yeah, yeah especially wasn't it like the first fight with the galleys running around, and you lost the first galley quite yeah. early, and you couldn't repair it. Yeah, yeah you yeah. were trying to repair it, mm -hmm. weren't able quite yeah. to, to do so. And like deni uh, getting denied by the forced dock for quite some time. Oh right? yes, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. 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 I was, I was hoping that he wouldn't think that I was going to keep making uh, galleys in my three docks, okay. that he would stop producing enough. So he made a transport ship. I'm not sure. Yeah, oh, we wow. saw it. We saw that? it. You saw it because you were actually winning. Why yeah. would you make a transport ship? I was going to land. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay, <laughs> well, I guess we could guess that. But you feel like you needed that in order to win the game because the water was under your control. No, I, I just want to land. Water <laughs> 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 is boring. Water is boring, I get to know. <laughs> okay, and then game number three ended up being... Uh, Ghost Lake. A Ghost Lake, that was the Did whole you map Ghost of Lake? Yo. Yeah. Yeah. I really should have used Restart after I see my yes. goal and mm. my barrier like this. Yeah, why uh, didn't you? Yeah, there were I don't know. Uh, the score was 2-0, and I was like, I don't know. 
been a cocky. <laughs> okay, you <laughs> felt you felt a little bit yeah, confident yeah. in that moment. You really had a little bit of a bad map, and you once one went forward, and at some point we all thought he you were doing really well. You were able to put up a tower, and all the golds of Viper were behind that tower, mm. so we're taking yes. control of those golds. Wow. What exactly went wrong with that forward? My eco was bad, and Viper did everything he has to do, and everything that's right, and he just put. I don't know how many wheels to to make a tower yeah. to, to right, <laughs> yeah. right in my face, and there's nothing I can do. Okay, uh, my my economy Maybe was too bad. Maybe your tower. Would that help? Not like, low help. De delay. Low help. Yeah, obviously the tower will go down, but it delays like the villager getting the tower down. Right? Yeah, it might delay a little bit, but I don't think it will change um, anything. But in question to uh, concerning your home epic, if you're ahead two zero. Isn't like Nomad, and you know you still had a restart mm -hmm. in viable option? Uh, I never want to pick Nomad. <laughs> <laughs> I want to <laughs> okay. kill him with real skill, no, oh, no, no luck. So real skill is more it. important than winning the tournament? Hmm? Real Showing real <laughs> skill is more important than winning the tournament for you? Uh, with the swiper, yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's nice. a very nice thing to say from yeah. Mr. Yo here. And let's uh, go back to that game from the Viper's perspective. You were able to clear that forward quite easily, I would say. You did. We lost like one, two villagers. Then and you went up. And lost, obviously, a lot of mining time. Yeah, but you went up killing four villagers from Mr. Yo as well. They were a little bit standing around. I oh, guess you didn't realize. There? Yeah. You no, know, you're on Ghost Lake. You're four, uh, forward villagers. Mm -hmm. um, like, they died standing and do nothing. Did you try to send them back? Did you try to fight them? No, I guess it was just there's no way. Anyways, there's no way I can send them back. I just, I just turn back to another war and do some eco things. <laughs> okay, and I just realized your viper wasn't aware. He was open the whole time on the left side of the map. But anyway, from your point of view, from that moment you cleared the forward. Did you have the feeling the game was completely under your control and you could control what is going to happen? Uh, yeah, I felt like I was in command of the game, right? But um, mine's eco is like it's hard to predict how strong his eco was back at home. Because he went forward, he made one range. Like that's the only reason I was able to clear it because I had like a lot of skirms while he had no army mm -hmm. to defend. Mm -hmm. So um, like I never, I didn't, I wasn't sure how strong his own eco was, but like I knew his map was pretty bad. So I just sent him skirms to if I idle his barriers, I remove some of the surface area for the gold, and I felt like. Um, like I also could send my skirms back and his wood on the right side. So I felt like from that point I had a good advantage, but like I had to play, play it safe to make sure I win. Yeah, and then uh, that game four was whole map of the Viper because he was the one coming from the winner's brackets. Did you feel like that played a huge role, having a second whole map and not Yo to actually get you back on track on the series? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that probably it might have saved my, my series this one. but. Uh, I don't know what second home. What would you picked. What would you have picked, Mr. Yo? If you had two home maps, what would have been your second home map? Uh, Regicide. Yeah, maybe. Regicide Fortress. Yeah. Well, Regicide. then I don't know. <laughs> look at that. Anyway, uh, that, let's talk a little bit about that game. Mr. Yo had a very unlucky uh, dock placement. Uh, you had no deep fish next uh, to it, right? What What did you think was going to be your strategy from that point on? Mm, <laughs> there's no strategy. I just think. Uh, Maybe I can win uh, if his <coughs> star is so bad, but uh -huh, it uh -huh. isn't. <laughs> so yeah, so you sort of felt like you were behind from the start on yeah, that yeah, game. Yeah, yeah. And uh, there was two sheep missing for me. Two sheep missing, oh, yeah. Uh, so, yeah. So so I had to start making wheels for a while to... Yeah, you were behind heavily in villager protection yeah, there for yeah, sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, that was the game. Well, was not uh, too Mary's st too much story to that game, and then came Chaos Pit. Yeah, what kind of maps you wanted to see? Yo? Yeah, I'm, I'm really interested. Y you know the WSUG map pack. There are six maps. Which one were you hoping to get? Uh, the one. Oh, with the hill uh, yeah. uh, uh, in the middle, Acropolis. Crater Lake, Acropolis. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, something like that. Like the you know, land map. Yeah, you start on a hill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's Acropolis. Yeah. What, about, okay. what about El Dorado? No, no. <laughs> that was like too. That. I don't know. I never have a good strategy for the game. Oh, okay. Okay. okay, but you went uh, ended up being uh, WSVG Chaos yeah, Pit, it. and what? Something very interesting that we noticed on the first game, it was restarted. You went for the closest wood and not for the outside yeah. wood. Was that on purpose? It was in that game, but then I 
thought about it and I changed it for a it second. It changed your mind. Uh, Jordan got really scared when he saw yeah, you going yeah. to the short wood. I changed my mind. I thought I, I, like I, I didn't really think about the strategy at first, but then like after we restarted, I got time to like think and look at the, like look quickly at the map and then think a little bit and then I realized I need to go for the outer outer wood first. And you did a very nice amount of laming in that game. Were yeah. you expecting so much laming with one villager, Mr. Yo? <laughs> no, yeah, well, I guess we all but weren't. Aren't we supposed to have one stone each? Yeah. You did you have, but you're. Your yeah, but was that one to the left? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah. guess. It was closer to him. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was closer to him, but yeah. Yeah, you did. I, I was like, I walled that stone, and I saw, oh, the second stone, what, what's the, what does this mean? Like, so I walled that one as well. Yeah. And then I went to scout for my own stone in my back, and I never found it. So, well, you yeah. did have one at the back, but it was behind the tree yeah, line. Yeah, that's so like one of the outside. So the one you walled on the left-hand side would have been the other yeah. stone. Okay. Yeah. Okay, but from Mr. Yo's perspective, what went wrong in that chaos pit game? <laughs> what went wrong? <laughs> <laughs> I lost my eagle war. Yeah, you guys were very close, both of losing the eagle warrior. I guess uh, you. I just, lost uh, it. You yeah, yeah. ended up losing it as well. But <laughs> what exactly? So <laughs> <laughs> but uh, what, what exactly went wrong for you there from that moment on, from the beginning? Because at some point we sort of well, you were very behind yeah. when it comes to villager count. You didn't have food from the start, of course. So that that is rough. But what was your strategy from that point on? Uh, my strategy is I don't know I I want to push him as hard as I can, but uh, he defend very well uh, with the tower and. And, and the wall? And the walls, yeah, wall. on the right side, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Tim. <laughs> Tim. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, it ended up being a really nice game, and you fought really hard to try to come back from it. Yeah. And uh, if you've got any more questions, Neely. Yeah, just like, what were your thoughts being down 2 0? I thought I, I can actually lose this, so I really had to like step it up. How, if you would have had to say percentage before the best of five? 100. 100? That Oof. you would lose? Uh, that no, you would win? Look, win, yeah. <laughs> I was, 100. I was so confident I would win. So. And after 2-0? Being like down 2 I was like, shit, what's, what's <laughs> going on? I need to step <laughs> Where am I 100% now? Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, I, was, I was worried I would lose, but after I won the Team Island, I, I mean the Ghost Lake, I felt like I had momentum as well as one more home map pick. Yeah. So I felt like, okay, this is going to the map pack and that's going to be tricky. Mm -hmm. okay. Mm -hmm. And what was we asked Mr. Yoki wanted to have Acropolis? What would be the map that you would wish to have? Probably Acropolis. I feel like our playstyles are very similar. In uh, we both prefer standard maps. Like we're not similar in terms of like he plays much more aggressive and goes forward a lot more often. But I feel we both prefer standard maps and mm -hmm. rely more on our macro and such. Even though I, I think I micro more though. Yeah. But like we have similar strengths. What thought did you put into the Civ choice? Did you know before we actually started today what if you will, will pick? I didn't. You mean, I, I had the last game. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, I, I, I didn't know. Uh, I was I was checking the map. Yeah, we could see from here. We could see from here. So that's what I'm asking. So you just made it up? No, no. Uh, I just forgot what was in the map, and okay. I take a look and, <coughs> and I knew I knew the Maya is the best. Okay. And when I saw him, is Maya and. You see, you felt good, like oh, good pick, after the good first pick, game, good yeah. pick. First of the game, yeah. Yeah, yeah. good. Mm, indeed. <laughs> okay, uh, that's it for me. Maybe take a look if the chat wants to ask something. But uh, if not, I will just congratulate you guys once more. It was an amazing match. Congratulations, Fiverr, for the first Thank place. You. Yo, you played Absolutely amazing. Great and I guess m not many people were expecting you to come to the second place and give Viper such a hard time. So you are definitely one of the guys that has been improving the most, I feel like. I guess you guys will, will confirm that. You've made a huge jump in this last year, I would make. I mean, one year ago, no one would put you on the top four. Right now, you're top two after this tournament. So congratulations for you as well, man. Thank you. Thank you so much. And guys, I think this is this for us. This was the last stream of the WSVG 2015 World Championships in the Maldives. Was an honor to be here. Was an honor to what be an honor to be with you. With you was an honor to get to know these guys. And they're not just great players. They are also unbelievable guys. And uh, we had so much fun yesterday playing volleyball and just doing a whole <laughs> lot of stuff. And I can't wait to go back to that. And uh, thank you so much, people, for being there with us. I'm just about to switch this off. Any last words? No, I'm totally fine. That was it, guys. Thank you so much for Thanks, being with guys. us. We will see you next year. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Bye-bye, people. Bye-bye.